Hey guys, how is everybody? I have not gotten on here in forever it seems, but I've been super busy with redoing my bedroom. We started on Saturday and here it is Wednesday and I'm still painting furniture. And it's so bright in here that I don't even need my ring light on. I, do, I see a reflection in my glasses, but I don't really know where that's coming from. Maybe my window. But anyway, I got a pretty good size Timu haul. I've gotten several packages in within the last like three days. And I'm going to try to get all of it out. One is a sponsored um, order so I'll do that one by itself and this one here is like three small orders but I kind of wanted to wait because it was just like a few things here and there and um, I think it's like three or four orders that I have here but I'm going to get right into it and show it to y'all and I didn't uh, write the prices down, but I will put them in my description box. That way, if there's anything that y'all see that y'all might be interested in, then um, you can get to them. Trying to get those words out. But I tell you what, it's so bright in here, my head is just blending into the walls. I look like I'm just part of the wall right now. But anyway um oh i got you know i went down and i was telling y'all uh what y'all thought about my glasses i was going to try to take them down and uh see if they could put lens in the ones that i had bought off of uh i think i bought them from t moon but uh i took them down and he said no that they couldn't use them because of something about the frame wasn't thick enough and the lens were too thick or something like that and the lens would pop out of them so i didn't get to use those but i i have on my old ones right now but i'm going to show y'all my new ones that i did pick they're a little bit they're quite a bit darker than the um than the ones that i these are the ones that i asked y'all about what y'all thought about them and see they're real uh you know real light and they are reading glasses I can see out of them but I wanted this because it was a little bit lighter but this is what they had it's um, it's kind of that color too but they're a lot darker I'll show them to y'all and see what y'all think that's this is those this is the ones that I chose but I've got so many, like, I don't never throw my prescription glasses away. I either donate them, because there's a place that you can donate your old glasses. I either donate them or I just throw them around in my drawers everywhere because my eyes really haven't changed in the last several years, um, except for this year it did. Now, they had to up my bifocals, but I know you're like, get on with the Timu haul, lady. But, uh... Anyway, I'm going to put these old, um, just prescript, uh, reading glasses, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I'm going to get right into my order. Um, I ordered some of these little things. They're like those makeup blenders, and I thought that they were going to be so much bigger. Like, these are teeny tiny. Like, what in the world can you blend with this? I'm going to open it up. Got my scissors and I don't need the scissors. See, look. Like, what can you do with this? Like, I don't know. It'd take you a week to put your foundation on. Maybe you can use it for around the eyes and stuff. I don't know. We'll find something even if it's to put it in my little jar that's so cute. <laughs> We'll do something with the... Okay. I'm going to make me a space back here so I can throw my little stuff over here so it doesn't get... I have all these teamy bags just sitting around. 
throw that in there. And I got another one of these little gills for the kitchen. I don't really need to take it out of the bag, but it's just like a scratch pad kind of. I've ordered this before and I really like it. And it stays stays pretty well, you know, put together. These things, they were just like really, really cheap. You know, I, I got these things on like lightning deals that was like 57 cents and stuff like that. And a lot of times whenever I show y'all the prices, um, my price is going to be probably different than y'all's. So, and uh, I'm just going to keep on with the little stuff. This here is a... Uh, I think, oh, it's mascara. My granddaughter ordered this. I wasn't for sure what this was. She ordered a lot of stuff, little little stuff in this order this time. My middle granddaughter. So, yeah, this is that. I'm going to take it out and see what the, the little brush looks like. Oh, it's so cute. It's a cat. That's adorable. She'll like this. I was going to see if I could get it undone. And of course, it's got plastic on this. It's in a box, inside plastic. Take that plastic off. It's got more plastic. Of course it does. Plastic, plastic. But that's okay. I'd rather have plastic on it than it all come in all scratched up and stuff, right? So there it is. And oh, it's white. I forgot that she got this. It's white. Ew, I don't know why I smelled that. It smells like mascara. I don't know. Why do you use white mascara? I don't get kids. But that's really cute. That's cute. That was a whole two minutes on. Here's another one. She might have ordered two of them. Or maybe this is a different color. Jeez. Takes you five minutes to get into it. How is everybody? I've been working my tail off. But I have been... Uh, I have been videoing and that way y'all can see my before and after stuff. I've just about knocked it out. I've got um, I got both of my end tables and I got the headboard to do but I knocked out the biggest part of it. My big long dresser and my big uh, the real tall like lingerie um, dresser that I have up over there. I did get both of those finished yesterday, so jeez. No, this is white too. It's the same exact thing. I don't know why she ordered two, but she has two. I'm sorry. That that took me so long, but I was thinking maybe it was black. Okay, next is this is something to do. This little tool here is supposed to be for ingrown toenails. I don't know what it is, but one of my big, my big toes on my left foot, I get it all the time, and then I'll go, like, get my toenails done and stuff, and they'll make it feel a whole lot better, and then, before I know it, it's back on there again, but this is this little tool-looking thing. I don't know how that's supposed to help, but maybe it will. Y'all let me know if y'all know any good advice about 
in-grow toenails. Um, I got one of these. I'm not going to take it out. It's just a letter opener. I think this thing was like 30 something cents. Um, I got another little doohickey. Take it out of its case. This here I got supposed to be well my I don't it's in a case like this I don't know why that black that black thing is just a piece of pepper that just fell on the floor but this is a blackhead remover tool take that oh it's like a pair of you see that how does that work that looks painful doesn't it it's like it's pretty good made I don't know that looks painful that looks very painful okay so that's that this is some pretty boring stuff isn't it okay I got this thing and this is for the feet too open this up everything's so hard to open it takes it so much, so much time this here is to take the dead skin off of your feet it looks like that and it has this little grater that snaps on there as well and then it has the little razor blades and it looks scary too but you put this all together and then it's supposed to scrape the dead uh, skin off your heels which I got it from my son because his, his heels are bad but I tell you whenever I go get I go get my um, when I go get a pedicure I can't even let them like take the scrubber brush deal and scrub the bottom of my feet last time she did it my foot bled because I always have on socks or whatever and I don't never like walk barefooted you know where I can build up like maybe a little bit of a callus so my feet are just really soft and can't handle it okay next these are some little uh, bottle cap earrings that my granddaughter wanted these are unusual look at that can you see it's just a little bottle cap. I wonder what it looks like on. Let me take this off. Oh, and I dropped it. Of course I did. Maybe it'd help if I put the back on it. It might stay on. Well, oh my goodness. Should I just not even try? These stupid nails. Oh, forget it. Y'all get the idea. That's what it looks like. And there's two of them. Sorry, I was really going to try that on. Okay. And here's a little deal that I got for my watch, my smart watch. It's just like some little accessories. And I really like this thing that they put it in, like this foamy deal. It really shows it up good. Look, that's... That's those. It still kind of looks blurry a little bit, though. So, that's real pretty. It's got these here is pearls. And then just a gold bar, and then some diamonds, and then some flowers. And I'm not seeing really good out of these glasses anymore. So let me put the other pair on. I, they kind of gave me a little bit of a of a headache because they did make them stronger, and um, they kind of gave me a headache the first day that I wore them. But that's those. I don't know if it's me or if it's the camera, but everything looks blurry. So that's that. 
I got quite a little, uh, quite a bit of jury in this haul. I do love the jury. This was ridiculously cheap and it's all tangled up. Look at that. It's really pretty. I was watching, oh, who did I see haul this? I can't remember. I think it might have been, I don't remember who it was. I watched so many people. Here's the earring. It's like a, um, it's a pearl with diamonds around it. And it has the necklace to match and the earrings in the um, necklace are all tangled up. Nothing's easy. I tell you, that's how it's been with the bedroom too. I took off all the hardware and uh, was going to buy new hardware for all of it. But it has so many handles because it's old. It's like... I cannot get this stunt loose. I'm so sorry. But anyway, there's an earring stuck in that. But here's the necklace. It's the little heart as well. And that's the earring right there stuck in it. And there's little pearls all along the chain. That's really, really pretty. I'll fool with that later. I just don't want to take up so much time because I'm already talking too much. But, um... The dresser, I was going to buy all new hardware for it. So, it's got so many knobs. Like, it's got uh, 2, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18. It's got 19 handles. And it was uh, $20 for 6. So you figure I would have to buy a lot. So I was like, forget that. Because I did buy one package. I'm going to take them back. And that was 20 bucks. So I got them home. And the dresser, the screws were wrong. All the screws were wrong. I was going to have to go buy all new screws. I might as well take this off. So I was like, just forget it. It was running into too much money. And... It was giving me a major headache. So, I know y'all are probably just thinking, quit talking. So, here's some more earrings that she got. I think those are kind of cute. They go in the ear like that, I think, maybe. Or maybe like this. But, those are different. But, they're cute. She picked those out. And this was a suggestion item that they just kept on and on telling me that they had a suggestion item for me. And I was like, okay, I finally bought them. But I bought these because they're yellow and they're like um, that boho kind of type stuff. Everything looks blurry to me. It's kind of like wicker. But those are cute. I like those. And here are some fake gauges that she wanted. And why, I don't know. But that's what that looks like. It's a star in the front. It's like this big, huge, ugly thing sticking out the back. But she wanted these, so... I told her no, absolutely not. She cannot have gauges, so she bought a fake pair, and that's fine. But, yeah, that's those. And this is another pair that she picked out. <laughs> These are pretty cute. They're loud. But it's a spider. y'all see that? I'm trying to cover my face. Maybe it won't be so blurry. But anyway, it's a pair. It's a pair of earrings. These are crazy. I was going to see where... I dropped the back. Of course I did. 
I was going to slip these on and just see what these crazy things look like. I'll be right back. I'm going to try these on. There you go. How about that? Here's the bugs. And here is those. Those are really pretty. I really like these. This will look really nice with my yellow dress. But yeah, those are not so bad. I think they're kind of cute. They'll look cute on her. It's not for me, but I'll just let them hang while I go into opening more stuff. Or maybe not. I'll just put it back on its little deal when I have it right here so I won't lose the back to it again. I'll take out the little bug. Yeah, those are super cute. She'll like those. They're really heavy, nicely made. Okay, next I got a ring. bought this a little bit bigger because it seems like every time I buy a ring I buy it the same size that fit the same finger and I have all of these rings that fit on the same finger so I bought this one a little bit bigger it's just it's just a black it's kind of open the sides Put this on and let you see how. Oh yeah, fits on that finger. That's nice. That's pretty. I really like that. Yeah, that's really cute. That's cute. That's a yes, yes, yes. I'm just lagging today. Like y'all are probably thinking. You are so boring today. Pick it up. Here's another ring that I got. Oh, this is another one of those. This is one of my favorite rings that I've gotten from them. It's that opal type um, stuff. It's that one. It's kind of got like the glue on the side I don't know my camera is just not focusing today or something that's how it looks on maybe if I hide my face I was going to see if I had that black that black felt stuff over here Maybe I might, it might show up better. Does it? It's really pretty. I wish y'all could see it. Like, it's really shiny and it's got glitter inside of it. It's very pretty. But okay, enough of that. Sorry. Alright, so she got um, she's been braiding her hair a little bit right here and she's been kind of putting beads in it. It's another phase she's going through. I got three three girls plus the baby and they're always going through different stages but she wanted these they're little um they're little beads that go in your hair and i don't really know how that works you twist it around your hair somehow you just i don't really know how that you wouldn't be able to see it in my white hair but i don't know i think she knows how but anyway she got two of those I'm just so monotoned and just like not very interesting today. What's wrong with me? Okay, got that. Here's another makeup deal that 
she put in the basket. A lot of this stuff, I don't even know what it is. Just know I needed to show y'all guys. This is just a pencil. Extra waterproof. It's just a black um, liner. It's just a black liner. Y'all let me know if this video is like super blurry. I mean, I don't. I'm I'm on my Android phone that I always record on, and you know what I've still not figuring out, and that's my laptop. I got a couple of these little deals that go on your um, cut. I got mine right here, and I'm gonna take a drink of my sweet tea. I'll, well, put it on there, but then I'll have to go wash it. But look, isn't that cute? That made the cup so cute. I like that. I can't get it. That's cute. Okay, here's a box. I don't really know what's inside of it. Oh, oh, you know, it's one of those, you don't remember what you ordered, but whenever you barely take it out, you're like, oh, yeah. This is for my, uh, my other cut, the one that, um, that I broke the lid when I knocked it out of the back seat. But yeah, that's for my other cup. That's that. That was like two bucks. And I ordered several of the um, the replacement straws, but I don't think these are going to be long enough for those small cups. Maybe. Maybe I'm wrong. But it's all different colors, and they're they're not flimsy. They're hard. Let me see. No, they're way, way, way too short for the cups. Yeah, those straws are way longer. But yeah, anyway, these are good. Those are good. Those can be rewashed, and it's got like a little cleaner in there. Oh yeah, and this this is so cute. This is a little deal like you can hang on your purse or, you know, you can put it on your keys if you want to, but that's pretty cute. I really like that. I thought I had my purse laying around here. I'd show you what it looked like. But yeah, that's adorable. Got that one. And it's got that, it's a, it's a dupe for somebody. Right here, there's a, like a little teddy bear on there. On that part. And then it's got um, this little design. A little flower. And it's a dupe for someone, but I don't know who. Let's see, what else? Here is... Um, some more accessories for my smartwatch. It's some, oh, yeah, it's, there's a D with diamonds around it, and then just some, like, silver bars with diamonds and stuff. They're just teeny tiny. One's got diamonds, and two are just, like, silver bars, but kind of little different indentions. Really hoping y'all are seeing this, guys. It's another pair of earrings. Open these. Oh, these are pretty. I got these light blue ones for my light blue shirts that I have. The real, like, dainty blue shirts that I have. And those are really pretty. I'm going to change my glasses again. Maybe it's me that's seeing blurry. No, still blurry. 
But anyway, that blue, blue earrings are pretty. Let's see what else I got. There's another accessory for my watch. Or for my granddaughter's watch. She has one too. I ordered her one as well. Oh, this is the little like knockoff Mickey stuff. That's cute. It's just a little uh, deal that slides on the watch. And they're diamonds. I could slide it on my watch and show you what it looks like. But I got a white band on there right now. But it, it might show. If you can see it. That's cute. That's really cute. Here's another little uh, keychain or little accessory you can hang off of your purse. It's it's kind of like oh this is this is so cute. It's a little black ball and it has like a little um am i out of it it's got like that little heart and then it's got this cute little teddy bear and then it's got that thing that's so cute that'll be real cute like hanging on your purse cute 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 Alrighty, and here is, I'm going to try this again, because every time I order one, I order it too small, and I'm doing the right, the measuring, I just don't know what I'm doing wrong, but it's one of those watch cover, uh, face covers for the smart watches. It's that one. Uh, just about done with all this little stuff and here's a, a makeup brush that I bought I'm always buying makeup brushes oh that's pretty isn't it you know I ordered one uh, from them like this and I absolutely love it. It's so soft Yeah, that's pretty I like that I like that But yeah, if when I knock out the the last two end tables and then I'll get to start the fun part and that's decorating I love to decorate that it was just one of my favorite things to do. Okay, my husband wanted me to order these, and I ordered two of them. What it is, it's supposed to be a super, super fast charger for our phones. So, he said that um, the one of the guys that works with him has one, and he said that he plugs his phone up to it, and it zaps it he said it will be fully it'll be dead he said it'll be fully charged within like a matter of uh, minutes so he was like get on there and order me one of these and these were like uh, eight something so and it was the highest voltage of that you could um, use or something like that but anyway they were eight dollars and something some few change but I ordered two of those and we're gonna see how it works so he'll be excited that that came in he asked me every day did my deal come in did my deal come in and he asked me I think the next day and I said honey how long do you think it takes for them to ship it Amazon don't even get here that quick so here's this box I had to order me another one of these I have one in gray and I didn't want it to break or whatever and then me not have another one because I love this thing. This is probably one of my favorite kitchen gadgets that I've gotten from Timu. 
it's one of those uh, deals that you put your uh, soap in, fill your soap up, and then you just, there's the little stand and you just take it off and there's a button right here that you push and it, it, uh, the soap will dispense out like that and you just scrub it and clean it all off and this little, this, it's taped down but this little thing comes off and you can clean it like if it has any stuff that's drained down in there or whatever. But I really love this thing. And this was like $3.98 or something like that. But it's well worth it. I really like it. Because at the Family Dollar Tree, just this thing alone was $3 and something at the Family Dollar. So, it's this was $3 and something. It has a stand and everything. So, yeah, that's that. Okay, and I got this. I was uh, scrolling through Instagram, and this still popped up on, uh, you know, somebody was demonstrating this light uh, from Timu. And I'm telling you, I thought the thing was about this big. That's how big it looked on her video. It didn't look small at all. Well, I wanted one, and I ordered it because my granddaughter has kind of strawberry thing fixing to do her room next but um yeah so I got this and it's so much smaller than what I thought and it's still really cute but it's got a little charging charger deal I'm gonna take it out of the package it's still really super cute but I thought it was gonna be a lot lot bigger It's, it's soft too, like, you see how I'm pushing it in? It's kind of like a squishy deal. It's got a deal where you charge it on the back and let's see if it's charged. Oh, look, how cute. That is cute. I think I paid like five or six dollars for this thing. I was thinking that it was bigger, but it's still cute. It's still cute. And it'll look cute like if the room is not so, you know, it's dimmer, uh, darker. Because it's pink. I don't know if y'all can tell that. But, oh, look, it's got different levels. Oh, wow, look at that. I didn't know my phone did that. Did you see what my phone just did? It went all the way dark when I turned this light on. I had no idea that my phone would do that. Check that out. I did not know my phone had that feature on there. Well, I learned something new every day. That's that. That was fun. Or not that's cute okay so I got me one of these this is a, a, a little steamer iron I haven't never used one of these before I've always just got the big iron out and you know it's got a place where you put water down in it and I've always used that for years but I hear people talk about these all the time that you can just steam your curtains or what have you. It's the instructions. Here's a little measuring cut. I'm going to put this camera down some. It's up so high. And here's the little iron. It's got a little pad I guess you sit it on like that. Yeah, that, I'm really curious how well this works. Where do I put the water in? Oh, right there maybe? They didn't make that easy to get to. Or maybe that's the button to turn it on. 
I don't know. I'm going to have to experiment with this thing. But that's that. I really hope it's it's heavy. It's not real light and it doesn't feel like she just do it like that and steam it. I don't know. If anybody's ever tried this, let me know what you think. I thought that would be so much easier than having to bring out the iron when I just want to get a few wrinkles out here and there. Like that. Alright. Okay, guys. I got to show you this stuff that I found. And the reason I bought so many is because they gave me this special, like, flash deal on these, uh, on these cups. And you're not going to believe it. I wish that I could, um, I wish I could show y'all my phone so I could show you the price that I got these at. Um, I got these cups. Well, I got two of them at this price. And I had to, I had, I had, I ordered one, and then I had to have my husband order one because, you know, there's like a limit on it. So, I got this one, this, this new purple one, this new purple cup, and it's just like exact same thing as my other ones. They'll hold your ice for 24 hours. I go to bed at night, I wake up, and I still got ice in my cup. But this was $3.98, like... I know you're not going to believe that, but it was $3.98 that I got this cup for. And the reason why I bought so many is because they're going to be some Christmas gifts. I bought them to put them away for Christmas gifts. So I got the purple one. And then, oh. No, this is a different one. I'll show you that one in a minute. And then I got a hot pink one. Hot pink one. It's $3.98, guys. And I keep I keep searching on there maybe to see if they're um, having that deal again because every time they have one, I'm going to buy one because I have a really large family. And the women in my family would love to have one of these. So, I'm going to try to get them all one. And I would like to do like a... Uh, like a little craft deal where I can put their names on them. And figure out how to do that. If y'all know how to do it, y'all let me know. Because that would really be make them even, you know, more special. But if I can get them at this price and I can spend a little money on them to, you know, put the names on them. So, I got those two. And I had purchased this one before. I got it for like, I think I paid like eight for this or something. And then I have my light pink one that I broke my cut my lid on, but I got a new lid now. But, okay, I paid $12 and something for this one. But the reason why I got it is because I I just love it. It looks like the Pioneer Woman to me. Comes with a straw. But I really, yeah, this one is like $12 and something. But I wanted it. I love all that Pioneer Woman stuff. That stuff is so cute. I'd like to do my whole kitchen in that. Just so bright and cheery. But that's that. But what else do I have? Um, I got the baby. Uh, one of these deals for her iPad. Here's the instructions. And this is what it looks like. And it says that you take this black thing out. And that's what it looks like. I hope that her iPad fits it, but I would show you what it looks like, but she's not here. She went with her other grandma and they went swimming. But it's got a little kickstand on it where you can kick it up on the table and she can watch it, you know? And then it's got these, uh, this little strap that came with it. 
You know, I'm guessing that the strap goes on it right here. Oh yeah. That's so cute. She's got where she, she's, whenever I watch the Timu hauls on TV, she'll say, oh, Mimi, can I have one of those? Can I have one of those? Anytime anybody buys anything cute. But that's what it looks like. That's cute. That's just too cute. I get excited about the silliest stuff. So that's that. And, okay, now we'll get into the clothes. Bought me a pair of shoes. This is a light pink pair because I have so many like, tops that'll match these. And I, I really like these tennis shoes from Timu. I've ordered three pair of the white ones. But this is kind of a light pink. And that's a nine, a size nine. Those are super cute. I really like those. And they're lightweight. They just, they don't weigh anything. They're so comfortable. So that's that. And let's see, what else? My clothes. I'll get to the clothes. Well, it, it was nice to just sit down and take a break from the painting. And I've got to really get on it because... I've got to go to Garland and pick up, well, Addison. i got to go to Addison, which is a pretty good drive for me. i got to go pick up the grandbabies. They went swimming, and she picked them up. So I said, well, I'll bring them home. So I got me a pair of shorts, and those look really large. So I don't. They, they feel, they're really well made. They're real stretchy, but they are big. So, I don't know if these are going to fit me. But, you know what? If they're big, it's alright. They're comfortable. So, I'll take it. And I'll try those on. For y'all. And here is a t-shirt. I haven't gotten a chance to wash these. I'll just, um, show them to y'all and then I'll try them on and then I'll wash them which is really backwards from the way I really do it so here's this this is really cute what does it say bring on the sunshine this is a size I don't know what size this is an extra large. I got an extra large in this top too. That's an extra large. And it, it's the good uh, cottony filling material. I like this material so much better when it's like this on t-shirts instead of that shiny stuff. Yeah, it's 95% uh, cotton and 5% spandex. Yeah, this is nice. I really like that. It's a really pretty orange color, like y'all know I like. <clears> okay, <throat> hey, this is my granddaughter, so I won't be trying this on. <clears throat> Believe me, you wouldn't want to see me in it. <clears throat> it's a little halter top. It's really made well. Laces up the back. She will wear something under this. She will not wear this by itself. So, this will go over a shirt. That is super cute. It'll look cute on her. She layers. She layers everything anyway. And, got this for Miss Abigail. It says, ain't no daddy like Ain't no daddy like the one I got. <laughs> My son will like this. Of course, everything's backwards. There's some kind of mirroring. Mirroring. I can't. 
me, 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 whatever. Okay. Stop. There's some kind of effect on my phone that will, um, stop that. You know what I'm talking about. I'm going to go to the phone company because I've got to go pay my phone bill anyway. And I'm going to ask them how do I um, stop that from happening. Is there some kind of button on there I can push where you can actually see it the right way instead of, you know, like looking in the mirror. That's what I was trying to say. And this here, I bought two of these somehow. What I, what I do is I forget what I order. And on my husband's, um, my granddaughter had told him that she wanted one of these. And I knew that she wanted one too. So he actually ordered her one and I ordered her one. So now we have two. But it's okay. I'll take one of them. Because it's that, um, that long crocheted uh, sweater like the beige one that I got. But this one's black. It'll look really cute with the black. A tank top underneath that so yeah so it's all right I got I got one I got one and she got one so that's what this is it's the same exact thing and let's see I got another one of these um, Swiss dots in the uh, apricot color I really hate to try this stuff on when it's wrinkled because you never really get the real niceness of how nice the shirt looks on you whenever it's wrinkled. So, that's that one. And that one was in a large. And these, what size were these? A large. These are both a large, these crochet deals. Those those run about hmm, anywhere between eight and ten dollars those crochet okay I got this I got me a long sleeve shirt and I've got some more orders coming in where I've ordered um, some more long sleeve shirts for like more of the fall of the year because I've got so many short sleeve ones but I got this I thought it was a real pretty um, pattern and it feels silky. Like, it's very silky feeling. It feels really nice. And this is an extra large. I was going to see what it was made out of. 100% polyester. But it's not stretchy. It's not that stretchy polyester. It's, it's real silky feeling. And I think this would look really nice with, like, some black slacks. Or, you know, you could even wear it with blue jeans. You could dress it up or dress it down. I mean, you could even wear some distressed blue jeans and and this, and it would be fine. So, that's that. I'm pretty excited about trying that one on. And then, let's see, I'm almost done, folks. I got my granddaughter. She wanted this. She ordered a bra, and it's one that snaps in the front. And I'm telling you what, this thing feels so nice. It feels really nice. But that's that. It's got, that's the way it looks in the back. I'll let y'all know what, how she, what she says about how it feels on her. But, it seems to be made really well. It's so lightweight, it just, feels like nothing. I don't know how good these are going to be or how long they'll last, but you know, they're so cheap that even if they last just for a season, it'd be alright. And then the last thing, she ordered some panties, which it's all different colors. know what that says heavy metal oh but this is what that looks like there's black black and white 
black and hot, pink and black and red. I won't hold all those up because they're my granddaughters. So that's that. And that's everything. And I'm going to go try this stuff on it and let you see what it looks like. And then I'm going to get back to my painting. I'll be right back. Okay, here this is. And the pants are extremely large. I don't know why I ordered this size. I should have ordered a large. And they're just, they're really, really cute. But, I mean, look at, they're just, they're way big. They're way big, but they are so cute. I'm going to reorder these. I'll give these to my oldest granddaughter. She's bigger than me. But, um, they're real cute. They're buttoned in the front. Yeah, I'm going to reorder these because they're really, really stinking cute. And the shirt, the shirt I've got in an extra large. I could have wore this in a large as well, but it is 95% um, cotton, so this will shrink. It feels really, really nice on, but super cute too. I really like this. But yeah, this is a really comfy outfit. Like, I could really do this outfit because it's so big. But that's that. Here is the the beige Swiss dots. Of course it looks white in here, but it is beige. And it feels really nice on. This is a really good size for me. So this was a large. But yeah, this is really cute. I really like this. Just said. But yeah, it's a really nice, um, like cream color, beige color. I don't know if y'all be able to see it. it. Might be better whenever we're just watching this instead of, you know, me looking at it like this. A lot of times whenever it plays back, you know, on like the TV or whatever, then it, it's a lot different from me just watching it myself. But yeah, this is cute. Okay, this is this one, guys. I really love this. Like, it's so pretty. And it's long, and it feels so nice. Like, it's it's thin. It'd be great for the, like, the fall with, like, a really pretty, um, you know, sweater over the top of it. And, you know, wear it with some really nice jeans or, you know, and tuck it in like that. Of course, not these pants because they're not looking so cute on me. But yeah, tuck it in with like a brown belt and some cute shoes. Yeah, that would look super cute. Super cute. Yeah, some nice earrings. Like, I'll have to put a whole outfit together and show you this, this shirt because this shirt is super cute. Yeah, I like this. I think I got some more longer sleeves that's coming in that I have purchased because I got them like really cheap. They're like five dollars or something. So I ordered a few of them. But yeah, this is cute. Y'all like this? Yeah, this would be super cute. Just tucked in with a belt and some accessories. It would look really nice. Really super nice. So that's that one guys. Here's this one. I got my I got my beige bra underneath here and it's really wide. This is one of my um, Timu bras that I had bought and it's beige. Y'all gave me that advice to wear my beige bra underneath, you know, a lot of stuff and boy, it works great. So, yeah. But anyway, this is this. I just put a black tank underneath it, but this would look really cute with a pair of, um, with a pair of, like, uh, distressed jeans on, you know, and maybe tuck this part in and put, like, a really cute black belt. I got a black belt that's got some, a lot of silver on it. It'd be cute with some nice big black earrings. Yeah, that's cute. That's really cute. It looks like one shirt because you really can't tell because I have this, but 
that's what it looks like. You could put a white underneath this where it show the it would show the style of the shirt, but if you're here in person, you can really tell it. But that's super cute. I was gonna I was gonna slip on my shoes and let y'all see how they slip on me. You can kind of see my somebody asked me not to have the TV playing whenever I did my videos and I'm sorry I forgot to turn my TV on off I wasn't even thinking about it so sorry about that try this other one on I'll let you see how these shoes look they're super comfy you can kind of see my dresser over there and then in the back, I still got to do a lot of touch up to it and stuff, but I did finally get the hardware on that. And the before and after pictures are crazy. You're not going to believe it. But anyway, let me see if you can see these tennis shoes on me. Let me get way back here. I don't even know. Let me put the deal down. I don't pay attention to my extremely white legs. But that's the shoes. Yeah, these are really cute. Nice color. They don't look so great with these white, funky socks that I have on. Or these enormous, really big pants. But that's that. So, let's turn y'all sideways. Oh, well, that's this haul, guys. And, got a lot more stuff to show y'all. Um, I'm going to try to get it all out. Uh, this week or by the first of next week anyway but uh that's that and i hope y'all liked my video i know it's kind of bummed out and just like Bleh. but i always appreciate it i always appreciate everything that y'all send me or um chat all the chats and just Y'all are so, so, so nice and sweet. And I just love, love, love talking to y'all. And um, I didn't even tell y'all my name for those that don't know me. Hi, I'm Diane. <laughs> but anyway, I love y'all. Always, always lots of love coming from Texas. Bye now. See you next time.